On a recent trip to Rome, I had the opportunity to sit down with Cardinal Luis Antonio Tagle, prefect for the Congregation for the Evangelization of Peoples and the former Archbishop of Manila in the Philippines. It was an honor to speak with Cardinal Tagle, and we're glad to be able to share part of that conversation here on Nightcast. My father was a member of the Knights of Columbus. No, so I grew up seeing my father going to the parish you know, to attend this meeting of, of, of a group of men called the Knights of Columbus. And I remember when he uh, became like a fourth degree knight, he came home with this white tuxedo and uh, this hat and uh, sword, and we were, wow, what's happening here? So the images were there. But we knew, I knew, that the Knights of Columbus is church-based, parish-based, so it is not just any club, <laughs> not just any gathering, and uh, they were very active in church. And the spirit of fraternity in our world uh, where there's so much suffering, you no, know, human caused disasters and natural disasters, and uh, again, the woundedness and division, etc. I see how Caritas as the uh, arm, the social and caritative arm of the church really does evangelization and helps in the healing of wounds. I remember visiting a place where there was not a single Christian. And uh, uh, in, 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 uh, they, they staged a, a program of thanksgiving for Caritas. And the head of that village said, you Christians, you are different from us. Very, very different. But why do you think of us? Why do you come here? Why? And, and he asked that question, you know, with, a, uh, I, I should say, curiosity, but it's more than curiosity. I think he was, like, magnetized by the mystery of, of this very concrete acts of love. And I myself felt that he was opening the door for me to proclaim the gospel. So I said, our Lord and Master, Jesus, taught us to love everyone, to love everyone. And he said, privately, I want to get to know your Master. So, yeah, through concrete acts of charity, if we Christians do it clearly as an expression of love of God, you know, that will somehow be felt and sensed by others. And it's a, a point of healing. You know? Peoples of different religions, they somehow get attracted 